Oriental, Oriental Bittersweet. That is this vine. This huge thing that I chopped that climbs up into these trees and just strangles them. They twine up like this, twist it around everything. And you see the leaves are dying now because I cut their main source of sustenance. They won't have these bright orange roots. They're not as bright anymore because I hit them with poison. But you will find bright orange roots just extending all the way through your rubber. You'll know where the root is because as you see, it has these shoots coming up. See, I know the root is under there. I know the root is going out over to here because there's one. I've sprayed these, they're all dying. I know the root is over to here. That's as far as the root goes, unless that's one right there. <laughs> but you can see how far out the root goes. There's one right there that's not dying yet. We're going to spray it again. But that's how far out that root is. I ripped a lot of that up. Also, they'll do this. Uh, where is it? They do this so they can reach up. So they can reach a branch above they wrap around themselves. That's three or four vines wrapped around itself and it keeps extending up, I cut it, keeps extending up, extending up until it reaches a branch. That's where it used to connect up right there. And then climbs up into the tree, but I cut it off. There's some more over here that I cut off. Shoot, did I miss that one? No, I got that cut. That's cut. That's cut. So, you see how big that root is. The thing gets heavy as hell. It just goes up and strangles the tree and cuts it off. And I think I can zoom in to the top where you can see it's all the way at the top of the tree. You can see way up top there. That's how far up that thing is going. And over here it's starting to die. You used to be able to see the berries. What it does is it... You can't see the berries anymore because they're, they're dangling down because they're dying. It climbs to the top of the tree. And then it makes a ton of berries. Oh, you can see a berry right there. See if I can zoom into it. You can see a berry right at the top of that, those two leaves. They're green because they're supposed to turn reddish, I think. But they're sitting there green because I cut the main vine. So what they do is they create a ton of berries. The birds come in, eat all the berries, and they fly all over here and shit. The seed is out and the, and the vine spreads. That vine is probably 20 years old. I just noticed it because of all these orange roots going through my yard. It's an invasive species from China. So whenever you see that vine, you see it's got bright orange. See that was brighter, but it's, the vine is dying because I sprayed it. And on the bark, you're gonna be able to see orange. Well, you can't see it now because it died. But in the vine, if you pull the way in, in between all the bark, you'll see the orange in there. You can't see anymore because the vine is dying. But when you get real close, you'll notice it because it'll be the same color as this orange. You'll see the hint of it all up through there because this has bark on it. You kind of see some of it there. Uh, there's a certain poison. Uh, it's the, the poison ivy killer will also kill this. It's got the, what is it? Tri tri Triplocoin in it or something? I forget the name of it. Tripoclear or something? You'll see it. It, it starts with TRI. And I think ends with CLR. CLYR. Yeah, those are definitely all berries sitting right there. All, all now dead. 
not ripening because I cut it off. There's a whole bunch of dead up in there. Finally, the tree's going to be able to live again. So if you see these vines, kill them, cut them, kill them, kill the roots. Once you cut its main um, chlorophyll source, which is all its leaves, the root will become weaker. The root's going to only have these to get chlorophyll from. So you want to kill those too with the, with the poison ivy killer, the vine killer. I'm going to have to respray those, they're not all. They're not all dying, most of them are. Tipping over. There's one over there tipping over. Bro? Yeah. Oh, damn, you hit my camera, girl. I wonder if I got that on the camera. <laughs> Shit. I turned the camera.